Hello my darlings, so today I am going to make a set of coasters. So this is going to be really cost efficient guys. I got this from the dollar store. So it comes wrapped up in this cute little twine kind of ribbon already so it's ready for you. And they're kind of like these compressed wood coasters um, and four of them for a dollar. So it's really great to experiment with and if, you know, if you're on a budget this is a great way to do it. Alright guys, so what we're going to do first is we are going to get our coasters and I tape the sides of them like this alright because I want the sides to be nice and clean I'm gonna get a cup and I'm gonna put this on it just like this so this is how I'm gonna pour guys so when you get these coasters and you can use tiles as well I just haven't found the nice size or the nice straight tiles that I've been looking for so I saw these and I thought hey why not try them out so what we're gonna do is we're going to tape all the sides of these so the sides are nice and clean and so the bottom of this stays clean too and we're gonna set it on a cup, okay? So that's the first step of this tutorial that you guys are gonna do. So you're gonna get that ready guys and put it aside. A couple of the things that I'm gonna use today, I am going to use Floatrol where I get it Home Depot or any home kind of tool store, I guess. Um, and then I'm going to use silicone because I love the way my cells turn out when I do that. So I'm going to use these two in my colors. Um, I am going to be using craft sticks to go ahead and mix my colors. And these are again from the dollar store. Depending on the size, they're either 60 for a dollar or 100, and 100 of them for a dollar. So super cost efficient, guys. All my cups are also from the dollar store. And these are the colors that I'm going to be using today. So we're going to do, I'm going to do white and black. My white and black are my alt art alternatives. So those are the colors, just white and black. And then for my third color, I want to make a really pretty kind of a purple burgundy. And I kind of like mixing my own colors, guys. So I'm going to be using um, Artist Loft's Brilliant Red. This is the Deco Art Premium Acrylic Print. It's called the Primary Magenta. I love, love, love this color. I added a little bit of the Liquitex Basics, the Brilliant Purple, and I added a touch of black just to make it a little bit darker. So don't be afraid to mix your own colors, guys, okay? So these are the colors I'm gonna use for now. Depending on how they turn out, I might add a little bit of gold detail later, but here we go, let's get mixing.
Okay guys, I really love how these came up. Every single one of them is a little bit different, but they kind of all match because they're the same colors. And this is what I love about pouring. They're never going to be exactly the same, but they're in the same family. And I love, love, love that. Alright guys, so I'm going to wait for these to dry. And in, in another video, I'm going to go ahead and do the same process, but I'm going to be adding a coat of resin on top of these to seal them for them to be coasters. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys learned. Definitely try this out, guys. And if you guys do any posts about it, make sure you tag me on Instagram. I would love to see what you guys are doing. And that's it, guys. So I hope you guys had enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and I will talk to you guys soon.